We are gathered here today to show our support, to encourage, to celebrate the covenant that Daniel, Haley, and Julia Robles are making with one another today. The marriage they are creating has roots in themselves and also in love, friendship, and guidance that each of you have offered them throughout the years. Who gives this woman to this man to be married in holy matrimony? Her mother and I do. <laughs> Daniel and Julia have asked you to be here with us today because we are their community of loved ones and because they are learning the utmost value and importance of tradition. Let us rejoice in the way that life has led them to one another and brought them to this place where we now stand. Sometimes in the midst of living an ordinary life comes along a fairy tale. Daniel and Julia, you have both come here freely and without reservation, prepared to give yourselves to one another in marriage. If so, answer by saying, we have. We have. We have. Let us pray. Courage, trust, love, even unto your enemies. God, forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. May what is highest guide our vision. May what is highest open our ears. May what is highest guide our tongues. And may we pray fearful of the hell we could so easily and carelessly create. Deliver us from evil. Shine a light upon the corners of our dark hearts for thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. 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 Marriage is a union of two people founded in mutual respect and affection. As such, marriage should not be entered into lightly, but thoroughly and seriously with a deep realization of its obligations and responsibilities. Today, you will take your place as husband and wife. Today you have chosen to become one, and it's the beginning of the rest of your lives. Only the two of you can create a happy marriage through love and patience, dedication and perseverance. By talking and listening and helping support one another and believing in one another. Marriage is a precious gift, a lifelong commitment and a challenge never to let the sun set on a misunderstanding or anger, but instead to strive to love one another more completely each day. A successful marriage requires being grateful of each other's efforts to do good. And here's the key. It's falling in love many, many times over and over again, but always with the same person. <laughs> you prepared personal vows for one another. Sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. Daniel, when I met you, I didn't believe in much. Dreams seemed impossible, almost like fiction. But, but from that very first phone call, who you are and how you are awakened a fire inside me to always want to do my best. You are the reason I believe in love. You are the reason I believe in God. And you are the reason I believe anything is possible. I vow to always trust your leadership. I vow to never hide things in the fog. And I vow to always tell the truth, or at least not lie. You may be seated. Oh, <laughs> Well, you're not so bad yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Julia, <clears throat> you have given me the gift of purpose in my life. You have made my days brighter and will forever make my days bright. Your curiosity of the world around us has inspired me to think deeply about what I thought was the way of things. 
I vow that my love for you will never falter. My vow to you that I will be a strong man that you know and love. You have shown me that there is true love in this world. Your love and friendship is all that a man could ask for. I love you, Julia. Daniel, with understanding, please repeat after me. I, Daniel, choose you, Julia, to be my wife and best friend. I, Daniel, choose you, Julia, to be my wife and my best friend. I promise to love and honor you. I promise to love and honor you. To treasure you. To treasure you. And respect you. And respect you. To walk with you side by side. To walk with you side by side. In joy and sorrow. In joy and sorrow. For better or worse. For better or worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer or poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I vow to be honest. I vow to be honest. Caring and truthful. Caring and truthful. I vow to love you as you are. I vow to love you as you are. And grow old by your side. And grow old by your side. As your husband and best friend. As your husband and best friend. Daniel, do you promise your hand, your heart, your devotion to Julia, keeping herself unto you always from this day forward? I do. Julia, with understanding, please repeat after me. I, Julia, choose you, Daniel. I, I Julia, choose you, Daniel. To be my husband and best friend. <laughs> to be my husband and best friend. I promise to love and honor you. I promise to love and honor you. And respect you. And respect you. To treasure you. To treasure you. To walk with you side by side. To walk with you side by side. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. For better or worse. For better or worse. For richer or poorer. For richer or poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I vow to be honest. I vow to be honest. Caring and truthful. Caring and truthful. I vow to love you as you are. I vow to love you as you are. To grow old by your side. To grow old by your side. As your wife and your best friend. As your wife and your best friend. Julia, do you promise your hand, your heart, and your devotion to Daniel, keeping yourself only unto him from this day forward? I do. What we're going to do now is call the sand ceremony. This sand ceremony represents the blending of these two families together. Yours was red, right? Okay. Okay, take it out for her. He's right here. He's right next to me. Okay. So you have to pour your sand in, okay? All of it? Yep. Okay, right on. Hold on. Okay, ready, guys? Three, two, one, go. As they pour the sand, their individual colors into the glass. This represents the joining of the two families. And just as impossible that it would be for us to try and separate each grain of sand, so would this holy union. Shake it. Yeah, there you go. Shake it. Okay. There you go. There you go. Oh. Oh, Okay. Are there rings? No. <laughs> <laughs> Rings are a symbol that is an unbroken circle. These rings are an outward symbol of your commitment and your unending love for one another. Just as the circle has no beginning and no end, so does your love for one another. 
You may brand your, or you may <laughs> brand your wife her name. You can brand him for sure. <laughs> Daniel and Julia, as much of you, as much as you two have agreed to live together in this wedded union, you have promised your love to one another by declaring your vows with the exchanging of rings, with the blending of your families together. I declare that this moment forward, your separate lives are now one. May you enjoy a lifetime of happiness that is always as heartfelt at this very moment as it is forever. By the power vested in me by God in the state of New Mexico, I now pronounce you husband and wife, Daniel, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Daniel and Julia, please turn and face your family and friends. It is my honor to present to you for the very first time as husband and wife, Mr. and Mrs. Daniel Haley. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you.